My next fave has been a reoccurring fave. It's the Carol's Daughter Secretier Conditioner. Y'all, so I have to tell y'all a story. I'm real chatty in this video today. <laughs> um, basically, I worked with Carol's Daughter the first, first time. They were the first, first, first brand I ever worked with like three years ago. And I was so excited when they actually wanted to pay me to talk about their products. Um, and they were actually the first brand to also send me products for my very first meet and greet. So Carol's Daughter has always had a very special place in my heart because they were they believed in me when I was first starting out and they gave me a shot and it really helped me feel confident in what I'm doing and keeping and moving forward with with being a part of this natural hair game and being a guru and all that kind of stuff here on YouTube and so um, they sent me a ton of these uh, what was this yeah 2000 ooh, 2014 is when I had my first meetup in Dallas they sent me a ton of these to give out to all of the people that came to my meetup you got a shampoo and a conditioner back then and I fell in love with the conditioner then and then I kind of forgot about it for like a year and then I used it again for a while and then I forgot about it again but I just rediscovered it again in my arsenal of products and I'm loving this this conditioner is so good because it's so moisturizing and it's it's thick enough for me to wear as a wash and go without having to add anything else on it like that's what's in my hair right now this is all that's in my hair is this conditioner and this is oh my gosh it's wash and go is what three days old four days old and it's still is super defined my hair coiled really nicely this time when I did my hair so yeah this is definitely probably uh, one of my all-time favorites it's just one that just disappears and reappears and disappears and reappears whatever so so the next two products I'm talking about are makeup the first one is this Sephora long-lasting cold pen this is the one in like a nude almost it looks white when you put it on underneath your on your um, waterline under here I love this pencil because I've tried so many other ones that just run throughout the day like by the end of the day you can't even see it anymore it's just like dissipated and because my wa eyes water a lot and it just the product just like disappears um, but this one stays all day and it's a good price I think it's only $12 or something like that and it lasts forever the only reason why I just bought this one is because I lost my other one and I was super heartbroken but I got this one instead the other day and I love this next is a product that everybody well maybe not everybody but you know everybody has talked about and used and raved about and I was just so like anti it because I was like why am I spending $42 on a tinted moisturizer but then I was like you know what I have the money to, to splurge a little bit and try it out so I finally tried the freaking Laura Mercier uh, tinted moisturizer y'all I'm so mad at myself because I love this like this is so this is so good this is so good for your everyday lightweight coverage foundation I really don't have problematic skin right now um, I've been there done that um, and so I've been taking really great care of my skin but obviously it's really hot outside and I've been outside and I wanted to find something with more SPF in it and so this actually has I think 20 it's SPF 20 I'm in the color almond okay so my next two faves and my last faves are gonna be random food items okay so I've been on this health journey all right y'all we've been up and down um, real up and down <laughs> so I'm back to uh, challenging myself and I'm working out again and running and eating a lot better and all that stuff and so I found the best freaking granola in the world I love this it is the love crunch it's nature's path um, it's the apple chia crumble this is so good. I, th I think this is like my second or third bag of this. This is amazing on Greek yogurt in the morning um, or to just eat snack on it throughout the day because it's only got six grams of sugar. It's got chia seeds in it. It's whole grain. It's low sodium. It's rolled. Oh, it's, it's really natural um, and it's a great, great 
granola if you're looking for one. Uh, a lot of granolas out there have a lot of sugar and a lot of extra stuff that make them taste really good, but it's still bad for you. It's like eating a cookie. Um, but this is really tasty without, you know, the added sugar or anything like that. So my next fave is also a health um, conscious food, and it is the Frozen Greek Yogurt Bars by Yasso. These are the cookie and cream ones. Oh my God, they're so good. They're so good, y'all. Like, they're so good. And they're only 13 grams of, in, of sugar. So you're not going to get all the sugar and all the fat that you usually get out of ice cream. These are only 100 calories, and they are only 2 grams of fat. Yes, 2 grams of fat. Um, they have 5 grams of protein. These are so good. I don't know, know how they make them so good, but they're good. So if you are trying to get an ice cream fix, which obviously it is hot outside, so you want to eat sweet and frozen treats, this is a great alternative if you're trying to cut down on your sweets um, and trying to be more conscious about that. So this one's really good, and also the vanilla bean flavor is very good as well. So that's it folks, those are my current favorites. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Do not forget to like and subscribe, 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 subscribe. And until next time you guys, I'll talk to you later, bye.